welcome back. My name is Sam, and we're headed off to Far Star City today. Now, as we take off on this helicopter, I'm in good condition. I'm feeling great. My movement speed is on point. Our mission here today is to gather twigs, about 10 of them, and beware of other survivors lurking in the area. Now that we landed in Far Star City, we're currently in a PvP zone, which means we can switch between peace and PvP. If we attack a white name player, it will add you onto the wanted list. Or you can try to stay peaceful if you can, and try to avoid other players. Because there's a possibility they will be very hostile. Now when you arrive, you're dropped off by the helicopter, which then proceeds to ditch you. So you're left to fend for yourself until a homeward or shipping helicopter arrives, where then you can either exit the map, or you can ship off your supplies that you've gathered. The homeward helicopter seems to be very close, which is super convenient. <laughs> I'm gonna stay away from him because he is on PvP, and I'm not trying to die. I'm just checking out the city, seeing what's going on over here. Gonna gather a little bit of stone before I head on out. As well as I will actually be gathering all the necessary twigs to complete this part of the newbie guide off screen. This game relies heavily on gathering resources from nearby areas so that you can further develop your skills. You'll always need plenty of crafting materials to make your property better to create a delicious meal or to continue assembling a new weapon. Ooh, a carrot. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. I just moved to a new location, and it looks very much like Hope 101, but just a little bit different. More empty, which is it's not a good sign. <laughs> um, the first mission that I have is to go talk to Andy. He's in the town hall. Just taking a quick look around. I love these statues. Oh, look at how grand this is. Here's Andy. He is letting me know about my house on my island. <laughs> that sounds lovely. And they prepared welcome gifts. That's so sweet. Now my next step will be to run to each of the shops nearby and collect all my gifts that they've prepared for me. So from Julie, nice to meet you. She has gifted me an ammo box, which is so, so convenient, and I very much need that. Thank you very much, Julie. Um, I prepared, I prepared, I prepared. He's being a little weird. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go. He gave me a rock picture. Oh, I like that. More furniture, that's awesome. And from Liza. Hi, Liza. Um, let's see. What is she gonna give me? Oh, some hide. I don't know what I can use that for. Maybe I'll find out in the future. And let's head to my manor. I've never seen it. Let's see how it looks. I've never seen it on this location. I'm sorry. Oh, welcome home. Thank you. That's so sweet. It must be my neighbor over there. And here's my gate. Let me just check it out. Head on in. Wow, what an upgrade. This is where I can control my manor. Here's my home sign and look at my field, wow. So here's a quick overview of my base. Nothing too crazy, very simple. And here's just, you know, the beginning. We'll see how it turns out. <laughs> oh, I love that. <laughs> okay, that was too great. <laughs> it's time. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go with out of all hemp picker. So with this professional skill, you can get quick gather, primary hemp crit chance, secondary jute stems, jute leaves, knaf bast, and sisa leaves as well as enriched hemp gathering. 
So I very much did a whole bunch of research before choosing this skill. And by research I mean I just I, I checked YouTube and I I searched life after certifications and it seemed like that was the one that would entertain me the most. You know, I didn't want to be bored with what I was doing. And I didn't want to go with a weapon certification because I'm, I'm not a, a fighter. So I went with a gathering skill. And <laughs> look how happy I look with my balloon. With gathering certifications, you can obtain professional exclusive items. So for a logger, you can obtain boxwood and broadleaf. Miners can obtain silicon. And then hemp pickers can obtain juice stems. I was really trying to take a photo with the balloon. It wasn't working out. We're actually going to be heading to a new location. This is Sandcastle. It's not a PvP zone, but it's more for gathering materials. First things first, it's really cold. Let's find some shelter. Uh, I, I believe it's actually just right on over here. It looks like a little cave shelter, which is kind of cozy. I'm just going to gather all these quests. There is four of them, one to collect all the resource points, three strawberries, five crates, and to take a photo of an adult kudu. I'm actually just gonna head on out of the shelter and gather some wood and get some resources real quick. One. Uh, <laughs> oh, someone's helping me, that's great, thank you, thank you. Uh, okay, he's down, thanks. I appreciate it, man. I'm just gonna pick this up real quick. Just in case. Oh no, what did I just do? <laughs> wow, he runs really quick. <laughs> um I don't I don't think I'm prepared for this one. They must have a set distance they are able to run before resetting and returning back to their original location. So, this is <laughs> my first sandstorm. I've never been out in one of these. So, I, I'm assuming if you walk out here, you'd start taking damage. Oh yeah. Let me just back up and stay inside. I think it's time to head out. Just gonna use the postman, drop off all my stuff, send everything all back to camp. Thanks. I think I'm finally ready. Just one more iron casting. And my easy ISMG. I can finally make this. Thank you. You, thank you. The UCI Rainy Day Vanguard, Snow Elite, and the Collector's Edition are the three other skin selections besides the original. They can be obtained with an intermediate formula and enabled when your combat skill is over level 10. <laughs> okay, cool. I am done with part two of the third chapter of my newbie guide. Just going to gear this, equip it and reload it so that it is ready. It's time to head out and <laughs> use this for the first time. I'm so excited, wait. Let me, let me just, uh, I, I had to go, okay. I can actually use this <laughs> as fertilizer, so I'm gonna take this, put it in my, my small cabinet. <laughs> and, and now I'm gonna head out. Oh, look, what a beautiful night. I gotta try out this gun. And, wow. I l This is great. This gun was definitely worth gathering everything for. One more celebration. And just gonna take down this wolf. And I think I'm gonna end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you later. <laughs> take care. Bye-bye, guys.